tall, yeah. The In the club, got them bottles on replay. Trying to break a record like a DJ. All right, y'all. So the tweet of the day goes to my dude, Packers360. He says, at the drink, Kareem, I love your videos, man. If someone quits, can you upload two games? I was sad when I saw you only had a three-minute video. Hashtag Trill Team. To my dude, Packers360, I completely understand. I know exactly. I can completely relate to that because I sometimes I hate it when... My favorite uh, YouTubers be uploading small videos. So I'm going to make sure going forward that I do that for my dude Packers360. And to my dude Packers360, I salute. What's going on, y'all? It's your boy TDK. No, bye, bye. Man, oh, man, oh, man. So right here, as you see it, I got an undefeated season so far, right? So all I have to do, all I have to do. Is when this last game, I get my first round by like I like because I can't stand taking a long way to the Super Bowl. Taking that, taking a long road, you know that, uh, what's it called? Taking a back road, you know, hanging out with the goats, the cows, the horses, all that. I, I hate taking the back roads to get to the Super Bowl. So all I have to do is win this game and I get to, uh, get this first round by and I'll be good money, right? So that's what I was thinking going into this game, and you would definitely see what happens in this game. As you see right there, after getting converting that third and long, we end up getting a yard from Eric Dickerson. And right here on the second and nine, Eric Dickerson is running down the field, jumping in the end zone, acting a straight donkey. Y'all know how I do. And look at Randall Cunningham kind of getting up there, you know what I'm saying? Kind of feeling himself after Eric Dickerson got in the end zone. And come on, really? The popcorn hands pot. My dude Patrick Willis over here went to the popcorn party. Y'all know how that goes. That that right there should have easily, easily should have got another interception. We probably could have had another touchdown to pretty much put this game away. As you see right there on that last play, got a huge run with Barry Sanders right here on the first and ten. You see him trying to roll out right here on the second and eight. He throws an out route. Thank God his player falls down, so he only gets three yards. Right here on the third and five, he rolls out and checks down and gets nothing. And then, of course, you know he turns jabroni and goes on a fourth down and does not get it. So we get the ball back, right? So I so I was thinking, but you're going to see how EA does me. You'll see how EA be doing me out here in these mud streets. Right here on the second and ten, as you see my boy Eric Dickerson running with the ball. He only gets about eight yards. On third and two, my boy Eric Dickerson is running people over, looking Good out there. My man Eric Dicker said, feed his shoulders, making it look easy, yo. We end up getting stopped for uh, about a negative two yards. So the option right now, it's not looking too good. So right here on the third and, um, on the third and long, we don't get it. So I turned your brownie. I said, all right, you did it, so I'm going to do it. And look at Glitch Davis. Come on, Glitch Davis, what are you doing, yo? I hope Chase don't see this video. I'm not ever going to front. So right here on the third of one is he runs the ball with fat boy cheeseburger eat refrigerator refrigerator perio. This dude is too tough to bring down. I mean, if you have him at fullback, you are definitely one lucky SOB because the dude is just tough to bring down. He's a great asset to your team. You can definitely utilize it. As you see right there, he utilized them on the goal line. And unfortunately, he went for on two on me, which is fine. You know what? Because I did turn Jabroni, even though he started the whole mess first. But you know what? It's all gravy. But like I said, he's a great asset to use on your team. The man gets yards. He ends up making it look pretty easy for you. You look pretty smart using him, too. As we go into the third quarter. Right here, he's dropping back on the second and 13. Look at the rollout, but you already know uses old deck. I do this defense for real, homeboy. As you see, my boy Patrick Willis, he ends up making up for that little popcorn party that he went to last night. Y'all know how he do. And look how EA does me, though. Come on, EA Sports. You got to look out for your boy. You know what I'm saying? Like, but I guess they figured, you know what? We looked out for you. We gave you your one. But you know what? It's never too late. It's never too late. Better late than never. They end up letting my boy Derek Thomas get an interception. So we get the ball back. So you know at this point, I'm pretty tight. 
I'm ready to get get this hashtag fast break offense popping and get back in the end zone. You see me making corrections at the line and look at my boy Ghost Thurman Thomas get yards on the second and two. I'm sitting here making adjustments at the line and I'm looking. I'm running. I'm running and look at my boy Thurman Thomas. See, I got seven running backs. Hashtag chill team. Y'all know this. I have running backs for days. I'm looking to even the odds and I end up throwing an interception, which was my fault. Terrible read. I'm pretty sure I probably had LaShawn McCoy, Shady McCoy to be exact, but I, I I just didn't take it. So, shame on me. But like I was saying, like I was saying, well, I mean, we, we got in the end zone. Ghost Thomas, he definitely got in this game because I, 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 need, I need fresh bodies in the game at this point because normally I'm used to pretty much just getting that 21 skunk and keeping it moving but unfortunately this man is still in this game this game is far from over as we're already heading into the fourth quarter and i see this man taking a dive and when you see somebody taking a dive and then after that you give them the ball to refrigerator you pretty much know what's gonna happen you, you, you see him taking a dive and you can't really be mad at him at all at the time i wasn't a happy camper but when you went after the fact you really can't be mad at him at all because you know what? My man's trying to get a W just like I am. And it's not cheese. He's not cheating. He's not doing nothing that the game wouldn't allow or anything like that. So you kind of have to kind of just take the good with the bad. Right, I should have had an interception with Patrick Woods, but he did not react at all. And right there, Sean Taylor also had a chance at an interception. And then he goes for a two. And you know what? I ain't even mad at him. I'm not even mad at him at all. Because the next video. Wait. Just wait till the next video. Y'all go see. Right here we do take a loss. Looks like we're taking a long road. To the championships. It's been real. It's been true. It's your boy TDK.